Hello orchid lovers of the world. So I have an update for you. The green cymbidium that I had tried to repot that was in such horrible, horrible condition. Um, the roots were all rotted and everything. So I went and cut up all the roots and there was barely any roots that were even healthy at all. There was probably maybe about two or three and they're not even healthy. They are starting to brown up. So I'm going to be cutting those off too. Anyways, so after I cut them off, I put them in water culture. I was going to start with just doing the semi water culture method, but it seemed like it wasn't doing anything. So about a month ago, I started doing full water culture. So when the cymbidium was sick and had all those rotten roots was back in April 15th. So today is May 11th. So it hasn't even been completely two months yet, but I wanted you guys to see the progress that the cymbidium has gone through in the last two months. So I believe that switching it to full water culture made a big difference. So let's go ahead and take a look at this cymbidium. Okay, so there was no roots. I just left those on there just in hopes that it would suck up some water. But I wanna show you this amazing thing. Look at that. Look at that. It's been two months and now it is growing new root tips. And on top of that, there is new growth. So here's one. And then there's another one right there on top of it. And another one right here. And my camera's not focusing, but there it is. Look at that. Nice, big, plump new roots. And then I also found another new growth right there. And a new growth here. So it's doing really well and I'm very pleased with the progress. Oh, and here's another new growth. So what I did was I continually kept an eye on it and cleaned it out, cleaned the water out, and I took all of the rotten stuff out as much as I could, and I filled up the vase just about here where the root is just touching. can see here and that's pretty much it and it's been sitting here for the past two months and it looks to be really enjoying water culture I'm really happy because I really do love this cymbidium and I really thought I was going to lose it especially with it not having any roots. My how to save the cymbidian with rotten roots is in my video playlist. So if you'd like to check it out, please go ahead and find it there. So here's the roots once more. Okay. Just wanted to give you this quick update and I will follow up with another update if there is any further progress. Thank you for watching and have a great day.